I think it, it entails many components. Uh, one thing is you have to look at the penetration of the internet in the country. So as much as we have internet, and we do have a, a pretty good deal of internet freedom, I mean, the, the government in Egypt does not block any websites, for example. Uh, but they do harass the bloggers. So they don't deal with the content, but they deal strict, straight with the people. They go after uh, people who, uh, who write something that they uh, don't like. And that has been uh, increasing uh, during the past year or so, particularly under uh, Morsi, uh, has really gotten uh, just out of all proportions, if you you know you can be tried for anything that you write uh, that the government deems uh, uh, hostile to them, and you know we, so we have crimes such as insulting the president, and uh, of course we have segregation of religions and things like that, and people get jail sentences for that. Uh, so it's pretty serious, uh, but it's also the the good side of that is that people are fighting for for freedoms online and offline. Uh, and it, it's part of the ongoing struggle and it's uh, helped us a great deal. It's helped us um, come a long way in terms of uh, how we organize things, how we run discussions, uh, how you, I mean, every single demonstration is basically all organized online. And then you tell people about it, you use word of mouth to tell others, you use television maybe to spread the news if it's something major, uh, but it starts online, everything starts online. Um, what do you think is the biggest threat to the biggest threat is the government. Uh, the biggest threat is uh, is a regime that is so uh, fragile. Could you, sorry, could you just, just rephrase it to say the biggest threat in Egypt is... Okay. <laughs> uh, the biggest threat in Egypt is the government. Uh, it's a government that is, uh, I think, so fragile and so scared uh, that they are going every single... Uh, they're going after every single uh, uh, note on Twitter and every single, uh, you know, uh, status on Facebook and every single blog post. Uh, and uh, to me, that just give, gives me an impression of, of how weak and how fragile the government is. It's, it's about to fall apart and it's, uh, it's scary.